So I was just in a Facebook group and I saw a message there and it said, what sucks about being a small business owner, dot, dot, dot. And there were an enormous amount of comments. And just let me give you a few. Here it said, everything, doing everything alone, working all the time, finding good people, balance, can't afford a team, wearing all the hats and not being good at all of them. My name is Tine Kerense from Powerful Business Academy. I'm a business coach for women and I've created the Women's Blueprint to Business Success. And I help women to scale and grow. Now, what is my answer to why is it a problem? Yes, it is a problem if you have a small business because all the things I've just listed and many more are there. But should you remain having a small business? And my answer uh, to uh, my, my comment was, ladies, this is a trap. It's a mindset. You don't have to remain staying in your small business. It needs you to step up. It needs you to accept that you can't be good at everything. It needs you to let go of control that you need to do everything. And it needs you to start hiring people. And yes, I know that is scaring. And yes, I know it's not easy to find the right people. But there are platforms out there where you can find people and sometimes as cheap as just $2.50 an hour. So there cannot be an excuse that you can't afford to pay people to do work for you. The other thing is that you need to start automating. In a small business, there are recurring tasks typing over the same message all the time when you respond to people in LinkedIn, in Facebook. Um, there, there's so many things that you can automate. Uh, and the other thing is, uh, the other thing is that it's, it's you. You need to step up. You need to let go of a lot of beliefs. And if, if you can't do that on your own, um, search for help. I have a Facebook group uh, in the comments. Uh, you can, we, we will show you the link uh, at the end of the video. You can see the link. Join the Facebook group where I will be there to support you. I have 30 years of, actually 31 years, <laughs> it's a new year, of business experience of my own. And I know there's a lot of people out there who are willing to help you and support you but are they skilled and knowledgeable enough? You don't need one thing to make your business skyrocket. It's, it's not that when you start public speaking, all of a sudden your business skyrockets. It's not that when you write a book, all of a sudden your business is really growing. It's not that when you know who your ideal audience is, your business is growing immediately. It's a complex factor of many, many, many different things that you need to combine and find the right balance uh, in amongst all of them, which helps you to make your business become a great success. Now, I make a promise if I work with women one-on-one -on -one, that they double their income in a year. And I can only do that when I work with the right women, of course, the women who really want to work and want to uh, and are able to follow instructions. Uh, but it's also a teamwork. So I feel really responsible for these women that they are going to make that success. So it's not necessary that you stay in your small business on your own. If you have a big vision, if you have a big dream, you need to reach out to other people to support you and help you. I hope this been, uh, has been of help to you and I look forward to helping you further in my next video next week. Bye bye!